Hi, Marco Rowan Nasruddin. I'm presenting 20 minutes class, Pilates class, by Fitness Zone. It will be online. Okay, so let's start. And this is the music. Slowly from here, we're gonna start by your warm up. Okay, we're gonna start softly, moving your ankles, warm up for your joint. And reverse. So keep your abs in, make sure your shoulders are lifted, the abs already into the spine. And reverse, reverse. From here, let's go. Knee, knee rotation. And reverse, let's go. So it will take a lot of balance on the standing leg, on your abs, on the glutes. And now let's go hip. try So try to keep your body straight. Abs in, engage your core. And two more. And one more. And stop, and let's go reverse. Say hallelujah. Three more. Two more. One more. Change the side. Let's go. This is your leg. So again, warm up of the joints. And reverse. This is before we start to make sure your body is warm. And now knee. Knee rotation. Stop and reverse. Stop. Hip. Make sure my hip, right? You want to make sure your abs are into the spine. Make sure you're controlling the movement. Two more. Yeah. One more. And let's go reverse. Five more. Breathe. Two more. And one more. And relax. Now let's go for your shoulders. Open your legs as wide as your hip bones. Keep your abs in and stop and reverse. So we wanna make sure all your joints are warmer. And now, take your arms up. Make sure they are not jello mellow, right? Make sure the arms are straight, energized. And two more. Say hallelujah. One more. Thoracic breathing already is on, and now let's go. Circles, imagine you're doing a pedal, right? Stop here and reverse. So you make sure the spine is not wiggly, right? You wanna make sure it's stable. And now we are warmer. So we're gonna go down to the floor, softly bend the knees, and let's go, give me a child pose. Slowly from here, hands under the shoulders, keep your abs in, knees under your hip bones, opposite hands, opposite leg, hold up. So make sure your legs are not jello mellow, extend them, and change the side and change and change one more change hold now touch two only eight counts and four more three two one hold up now bend the knees lift eight seven Six, five, we're opening the hip flexors, rimming the glutes, three, and two, and one, extend, and close. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, change the side, hold up, touch, up and down, only eight counts, seven, six, Make sure you energize all your muscles. Five, four, three, two, one. Hold here. Bend the knees and up. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold, extend, and close. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, on the eight, stretch. Take your knees a little bit wider and bring your hands forward and stretch. So now we are ready to sit. So we can remove the shoes. Okay, so it was your warm up. I hope you're warm and this is how we are. Slowly from here, we're gonna start the rolling like a ball. So make sure you keep your Body as a ball. This is your warm up. From here, roll down. 
and exhale, stop. You want to bring your knees towards your forehead. Two more. Inhale in and exhale. One more. And stop. So advance. Bring your hands around the foot. Round your back more. Make sure. Okay. So you want to roll. You want to keep your head in C curve. And one more. And relax. Extend the legs. And here we go for your roll up. Slow. Let's roll. Slow it down. Keep your abs in. And slow it down. Take your hands back. Stretch. Inhale in. Exhale. Chin to the chest. Keep your abs in. And slow your roll. And stretch all the way forward. Two more. Freedom. Very slow. And exhale. One more. Inhale. Slowly. Exhale. Last one. So we can do it up to 20 seconds, 20 times. So let's go slowly to burn more your abs. That's how we are. Sit down. Make sure you are in a C curve. Make sure your toes are into a flex position. Hold here. Keep your abs in and slowly give me pulses. So make sure you keep your abs in and flex. You want to flex your spine. And three. Make sure the abs are in. And four. And five. If you want advanced, take your hands higher. So, kilma bhali idayi, kilma asab. More challenging, hands behind the head. I can see my elbows. Five more. Four more. Yeah, nice. Three more. And two. One, stay here, keep your abs in. Right leg. Eight counts. Seven, six, five, keep your abs in, four, three, two, one, chain your side, let's go up, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, slowly from here, roll down, all the way down to the floor. Take again a deep inhale, exhale, and stretch all the way forward. Open up your legs now as wide as a mat. Open up your arms. Make sure you sit up tall. If you're not flexible, bend the knees. And this is not flexible. I'm going to turn, turn my fingers, and reach for three, and two, and one. Come up tall, center. Turn, reach, three, and two, and one. Center, again, let's go. So we can go eight counts for each side. And center, again, turn. It gives you flexibility on your lower back, on your hamstring, and one more for each. So I'm doing only three reps. You can go for eight reps, right? And let's go. This is your last. Two, and three, and relax. Slowly from here. Let's go slowly down to the floor. And here we're going to start with some abs, lower abs, right? So watch me. Make sure you're not that position. You want to keep your back into the spine. So bringing your abs into the spine, it's not about the pelvis. It's bringing the ribcage down and the abs in. So even if I lift my legs for a tabletop, I am not in that position. And this is the biggest mistake, right? So you have to be in flat belly. And look at my neck. Make sure your neck is not like this. If you have any tension, okay? So my neck should be comfortable, my back down to the floor. So we're going to go as level one from here. Take a deep inhale, dorsiflex your toes to stretch and slow it down. Inhale down. This is your level one. We keep the abs into the spine. And only four more. So we do it eight counts. And three, and two, and one. Let's go. Level two. Bring the other leg tabletop. Kilma forward is Kilma ahyan. 
Kilma Bikhidan, this is the tabletop where the knee is in the top of your hip bones. It is harder, it's your level two. Now, this is your level two. You're gonna feel so much lower abs, you wanna push it really low. And only six more. Okay, so you can continue level two. Level three, extend the legs. This is level three, push your belly down. Four more. So let's see if anyone is advanced. Uh, follow me. Level four, I'm gonna keep this leg 45 degrees. Push my belly down, hands to the floor. Pick this leg up and slowly down. Push your belly down to the floor. And two. Make sure your feet are short as high. Pushing your belly down to the floor. And six more. So you exhale with the exertion of the effort. And four more. And three more. And two. And one. And relax. So we change side now. You remember? It was your level one. You can stay here. Level two. Bring the other leg. Kilma fawwita, kilma ahyan, kilma bitfisha la barra. It's harder. This is your level two. I make sure my abs are into the spine. My shoulders not shrinking. Open them back. Level three. Let's go. Again, is a fi ashkhas tujar abita. Please minch fi tahtrasun. Is a fi ashkhas mujar dahra. Stay between level one and level two. Lama tiwo, tata level three and four. Let's go. Level four. Stop here. Keep your abs in, shoulders on top, really high, and let's go. Only eight counts. And seven, push your belly down. And six, and five. Let's go, 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 Two, stretch, exercise, your ab power. Stretch, open your elbows. Use the biceps. This is your last abs. We're gonna change muscles. Five more, stretch. And really stretch. And four more. And breathe. And three more. Make sure you inhale for each count. And only two. And one more. And we can relax. Woo. Okay, so let's go into your arms. So let's go into your triceps. Pilates push-ups, right? So my hands under my shoulders. I keep my knees under my hip bones. Make sure the hands to have a small fist, so don't flatten your mel your hands, so make sure you have a fist. The power is not on the wrist, it's on the five fingers and the wrist. Hands are in two, under the shoulders, abs are in. Lift one leg, lift the toes up the floor, bend your elbows, keep your elbows parallel. You're gonna go down and up. Seven. So if you see my head, my elbows facing each other, this is your Pilates triceps push-ups, five more. Four more, three more, two more, one, hold down. Now take this leg up and down, and seven, and six, and five, and four, three, two, one. Stretch. We have the other side. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna change side. From here, extend that leg. The abs are in, slowly from here. Let's go. Eight. Seven. Keep your abs in. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One, hold here, take your legs up and down. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, and relax, stretch again. Okay, let's go to some obliques. From here, let's go. Same thing. So this is your obliques. Make sure your legs are a little bit forward to make sure your back is not in arch position. 
little bit forward, try to lift your ribcage off the floor. If you feel tension, bring a pillow, put it under, otherwise stay here. Let's go all the way. Make sure your pelvis is stable, don't go back. I wanna stay here. Now, bend the knees. If anyone is advanced, lift the other leg off the floor. And uh, let's go. Seven. Six. Five. Make sure you cage off the floor. Four. Three. Two. One, hold up, and let's go reverse. Keep your obliques working for you. Three, four, five, six, seven, ten, eight. From here, hold, run. Make sure your pelvis is stable. Advance, you can remove your hands. Make sure you're stable. Flex your toes. Seven, eight, change the sides, and let's go. Let's go. From here, bring your legs a little bit forward, and let's go. Up. So keep your abs in. Advance, you can lift the other leg off the floor. So we do eight counts, eight reps. From here, bend the knees. Up. Four, five, six. Hold up and reverse. You make me feel like. So you wanna feel, make sure you feel your external obliques working. Try to keep the ribcage off the floor. Four more. Three, advance, you can remove your hands. Two, one, and relax. Hold here now, let's go. From here, to do your back muscles, hold. So, if you have a problem in the back or hyperlytic position, take your legs a little bit wider, right? Ideally, we should be closed. If you have a back pain, we open them. So, you wanna squeeze the glutes, make sure your pelvis is square, and this is the hands. Right? Make sure your head is never like that. You don't want to have a neck extension. You want to make sure you are into your neutral spine. Level one, opposite hands, opposite leg. I go down everything. Exhale, up and down. So this is your level one. Level two, now I lift a little bit faster. I'm a little bit into back extension, thoracic extension. This is level two. Level three, I lift. Hold up, and let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and relax. Stretch before we go to the other exercise. Let's go. Slowly down again. Open up your legs. How deep is your love? So we imagine we're gonna be letter X from here. Inhale in, lift, close, open, down, up, close, open, down, up, close, open. Three more, up, close, open, down, up, close, open. Last one, hold, open up your arms, and eight, seven, Six, five, four, and three, and two. One, hold here, palm up to the ceiling, triceps, push. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Stretch your back. Give me a cat stretch. Inhale in, and exhale. Again, inhale in, round your back, and exhale. One more. 
and exhale. I think my time is over. Thank you so much and have beautiful workouts.